Welcome back to The Witcher 3. I want to continue cleaning up old, uncompleted quests in Velen. So right now I'm currently at Hindhold. And there's actually two quests that I want to do very, very far away. And uh, of course I'm going to fast travel to get there because, god, it's really far away. So one is Defender of the Faith, which is where I need to repair or like put back up those, those shrines. I have to fix all the damaged shrines. One is here, and the other is over here. So I'm going to fast travel to Condyle, make my way to this place here, and then there's also another quest, a uh, treasure hunt, I believe. Let's see. Or is it a contract? Nope, it's a don't play with the gods. This one. This one is also in the same area. If you remember, I tried to do this before, and there was that nasty wraith that was just way too hard for me to take on at the time, and it's a level 15 quest. But now that I'm level 12, I think I might be able to take it on. And it's near the shrines that I need to fix anyway, so let's just go ahead and do it. So let's fast travel to Condyle. Let's find a way down without killing myself. Double roll. Aw oh, yeah. I also really want to craft that new Witcher Sword. I can't remember whether it was steel or silver. But I remember I just got the recipe for it, or the, the diagram rather, and it was really, 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 really good. Also, I kind of went too far. Whoops. <clears throat> Alright, first things first, let's do the shrine. Come on, Roachy Roach. Don't look at the dead horse. Actually, that's a cow. Don't look at the dead cow. Don't look at the dead bodies. Don't be afraid, Roach. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Actually, a bunch of cannibals, like, killed and ate all these people, so it's really not fine. But, you know, it's fine. Uh, I don't think this is the way I want to go. Is it? Eh, I guess it's fine. Bees. I heard bees. Oh, hey. Run, Roach, run! Get the right oil on there. Oh my god, my sword's at 17%. Oh, Jesus. It's about to snap in two. Insectoid oil. Hello. Slow down. Nice. Destroyed this one, too. What a lovely statue. Beautiful piece of artwork, that. Mmm. Like some old hag witch. Looks kind of pregnant. Broken arm. Looks like it's screaming, maybe uttering a curse. So, oh, lovely. Alright, now let's go do... Actually, well, I don't even need the... I don't even need to do the quest. I can just mark it myself. It is right here. Hey -ya. Hey 
I hear harpies. Is it a harpy? Or is it something bigger? What is that? Oh, Jesus. Fuck, what? Uh, apparently it's wolves? No, no, there's something in the air, too. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. Uh, let's rest for a minute. Get my stuff back. I'm gonna try to shoot that out of the sky, I think. Yes. Yes. Mm, depends what level it is. That's a freaking griffin. What level are you? Oh, 25. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Good day, sir. Good day, hey, sir. I ragdolled. Griffin 1, Geralt 0. Thank God it autosaved after I rested. Alright, now if I remember right, I think this is something that's better fought in the sunlight, right? Uh, what are you exactly? You're not a Night Wraith, right? You're a... Those wolves are creeping me out. What are you again? Noon Wraith. Let's go ahead and read the bestiary entry again. Exactly what a noon wraith is. Ah, uh, your specter, of course. Do 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 do. Mm, they can be encountered at night, but are much weaker than during the day. Okay, so it's actually best to fight them at night. Okay, Yurden, specter oil, and moon dust. Let's get some specter oil on there. Actually, mm, I don't know if this counts as during the night, so let's actually just wait until. Midnight. Just to be sure. I might still not be powerful enough to take it, because I have leveled up, but I also increased the difficulty of the game. So, you know, I might kind of even out. There we go, my almost broken weapon. In fact, I should probably repair that a little bit. That 15%. Fifty-five percent, much better. Make sure I've got moon dust. I don't have it currently on. Uh, let's do moon dust and grape shot. All right, moon dust, grape shot, enhanced thunderbolt, tawny owl, which I'm gonna really need because I'm gonna need to Yurden and Quen probably all the time. I've got specter oil. Okay, I think. Whoa. I think we're good. It looks like it's just hanging out there. Which, if it doesn't spot me, which it probably will, but if it doesn't spot me, then I can actually loot what I wanted to loot without attacking it, because I can't loot during combat, and that's the problem. Alright, let's see if I can quick loot. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, that didn't do too much damage. Do that again. Whoops. Kind of freaking out here. Just calm down. Calm down. Let's get my moon dust. Yeah, 
willing to stop healing. Okay. Yeah, uh, I think we're actually making progress. Yeah, we're, we're actually making good progress. Okay. Do that so I can get my Yurden back sooner. Got it. Ooh, did I get it? Oh, yes. All right, that was a good fight. That was a good fight, nice. I'm happy with how that went. Not sure how useful those crafting ingredients are, but the most important thing is that I can finally freaking loot this. Those aren't too amazing, but the runestone, uh, hmm, this says common. Let's take a look at that. What is that runestone? Marana. Three percent chance to poison. Eh. That loot was really not that amazing. Ah, well. Alright, let's go repair the final shrine. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I didn't get you. Crossbow. What kind of crossbow? A level 18 crossbow. I'm jealous of Geralt. Geralt can whistle. I can't. Go, go. Other than the ability to whistle, though, I think I think I'm equally matched in all of his other abilities. I like it when there's dramatic music for two seconds and then it ends. It's like da da dun dun da da dun da dun dun da da dun dun dun. Ooh. What the heck is this place? This looks cool. This is a question mark, isn't it? Uh, I think it was. Looks like it's guarded treasure now. Ah, uh, looks like we got some more specters. Looks like my oil wore off. Probably should have reapplied that during the fight. No matter. Let's go ahead and take one swallow. Literally. Ugh. That's a bad start. That's a witcher symbol. Just like in the boat. Hmm. Might want to look around some. Except this time I can actually examine the symbol, unlike the one in the boat. Felon longsword. Assassin's trousers. That actually might be really good. Because I think I'm wearing assassin's boots right now, and they're really good. Also the sword. Let's take a look. Steel sword. Steel, steel, steel. That one. 
Oh, oh, it's a level one weapon? Nah. Nah, man, nah. What about the trousers? Oh, I've already got Assassin's trousers. Mm, except these are level seven, the ones I'm wearing are level six. Although the ones I'm wearing give more vitality. Hmm. Weird. So th they both have the same name, but the ones I'm looking at are higher level. However, even though they're higher level, they actually have worse stats. Oh, actually, no, that's not true. I thought the minus three armor was because my current trousers are damaged, but actually they're not. So no, it does have a little bit more armor, but other than that, eh. I don't think it matters, honestly. They're both pretty interchangeable. I guess I value the vitality more than three armor. I don't think three armor really makes much of a difference. Yeah, I'm going to stick with my current ones. Oh yeah, somebody gave me a tip too. They said if I go into the character screen and then press C. Yeah, C for player stats. It gives you extra stuff. Ah, it does. Cool. So I guess like your total armor, damage per second. Cool. Yeah, it gives you a bunch of statistics. Quinn is 232 physical damage reduction. Very nice. Total stamina, your adrenaline points and stuff like that. And my total playtime. One day, five hours? Damn. Yeah, look at that. Because of my uh, cat school stuff and all my light armor. Silver sword, strong attack, critical hit damage, 580. Whew. That is insane. Cool. Wait, so is that all the treasure? Is this place finished? Yep, it's finished. What the? Oh, I guess there's a wraith left. Whatever, I don't care about you. Faster. I've got a statue to fix. Slow now. Hmm, for a second I thought there might be cannibals. Wait a minute, are they chopping down the statue? What in the hell? You the ones destroying shrines all over Valen? What's that got to do with you? What's it got to do with you? We are the Heralds of Lightning. Heavy drops from leaden clouds. Unleashed, the Lightning's name shall be Overman. What? Huh? The locals claim the gods are unhappy. No fear of their wrath. The wrath of the gods? The gods are dead. We but dispose of their rotting remains, the dying embers of superstition that harms. Great. Need a favor, though. You gotta clean up after yourselves here. Then go back to wherever you came from, dispose of those embers there. Religion is the opiate of the masses! The gods are dead! <laughs> Thus speaks Master Friedrich of Oxenfurt! Common folk fear religion and the priests, not the gods. And this fear enslaves us in fetters of ignorance. We must forge a new morality, or rid ourselves of morality altogether! Okay, so these people are basically... <laughs> <laughs> What's their plan? Do they think if they cut down the statues, that's going to kill religion? Oh my god. Do they really think that's gonna work? <sighs> I mean... <laughs> like, I want them to stop, but I'm not gonna kill them over this. That's just dumb. Let's, let's see what happens. Amusing as this little show is, I'm getting bored. Leave, and don't come back. Oh, what? Or I'll tell on you to the headmistress. <laughs> Repression! Attack the system's lackey! Oh. Seriously? Oh, we're just fist fighting. Okay, let's do it. It could be quite profitable. Who's next? Come on. Come on. 
come closer. Am I killing these people by punching them? I, I swear they're dying. I don't want to actually kill them. But they did attack first, so... Like, I don't feel too bad about defending myself. Well, I literally just murdered them with punches, I guess? I, I think they're dead. I guess they're dead. Alright. Well, this one's still fine. Let's go. Did that complete the quest, or do I have to go back? I didn't actually pay attention. I think that completed it. Looks like it. Yeah, looks like it did. Okay. Um, there's not too much left to do in Velen, at least as far as quests that I already have. There's plenty of places to go to find new quests, though. And I still haven't done much Gwenting. So let's go do some Gwenting. Also, I don't think Gwenting is a verb, but now it is. I also kind of want to check out some question marks. Oh my god. I'm going to be in Velen forever if I check out every question mark. Dear god. Dear god. Hmm. There's actually no fast travel places anywhere near to get over to Oriton. In that case, screw it. Let's go check out some question marks. Off we go. Place of power. Must be an equally powerful being to defeat. Who wants to fight? Mm, Come on. Magic. A place of power. No one. Really? Is this Axie? Oh, Ard. Ability point. Let's go ahead and spend that right now. Let's shove that into uh, refreshment. Allow me to heal 10% with every single potion that I imbibe. I like that word. Imbibe. What the hell are you? Is that a gargoyle? It looks like a cross between a troll and a gargoyle. Seriously, what are you? Whoa! Whoa! Huh? Holy shit! Uh, yeah, it's a gargoyle! Okay, I don't believe a gargoyle is actually in my list of things, is it? What would it be? It'd have to be an Elementa, right? Hmm. Cursed? Relic? Could be a relic. It's probably either a relic or an elementa. Hmm. Well, let's roll with one of them. Let's we'll see if I even have the right poisons. Elementa? I do have elementa. I guess I don't have relic oil. So, gonna have to hope it's elementa. What level are you? 19. Hmm. This might be a terrible idea. Come on. That was a critical hit and it did like no damage. 
Yeah, okay, this is a terrible idea. There's there's no freaking way. Ow! Jesus Christ! Nope. I'm out. I'm out. Roach! Alright, well, if that thing's so high level, then I'm guessing I probably can't take out whatever might be at the other question mark. Uh, I suppose we could try, though. But if that thing's so high level, then everything else around here is probably similarly leveled, I'm guessing. Take it easy. Hmm, what's going on here? What's with all these fires? Let's also heal a bit. What level are you? 18. Uh, no. Okay, this place is just too, way too high level. I'm out. Okay, where should we go? Anywhere but here. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't go check out all these question marks. A lot of them are probably just too damn high level. Let's do some sailing. Let's make our way to the boat. Make our way to the boat and then just sail on over to Oriton to do some Gwenting. Nope, 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 not gonna fight you. Not gonna fight you. Not gonna fight you. Guard of Treasure, what are you? Oh, level 13? Oh, I could take you. The freaking necker on my ass, though. <laughs> Jesus, you're fast. God, those things are really nasty. Acrobatic little bastards. <laughs> What's an Al Ghoul? Al Ghoul must be related to a ghoul, right? So it's gotta be a necrophage? That's my guess, and I'm sticking with it. Jesus. I already just lost my shield, even though it didn't really hit me. Again. Does it have some sort of defense? Is that the red glow? Oh. Uh, I think a Necker saw me. Okay, that just added it to the uh, bestiary. Let's go see. It should be under necrophage. Yep. Some nasty things. Axie and necrophage oil. Okay. Hmm. Piece of armor. Get ourselves some honeycombs. Take a look at that piece of armor. And that's what it was. Light armor, not as good. Nope, not as good. Hmm. This might be better. Yeah, it's higher level. It's got one slot. A little bit more armor. And it's still light. Yeah, definitely better.
<laughs> nice dive. <laughs> Geralt just suffered horrible brain injuries from bashing into the side of the boat. I've got the urge for Gwent. I am going the right way, right? Yeah. Okay. We're good. I think I just heard drowners. That, like, gurgling sound from underneath the water. Light coming from up in the tower. Creepy. I don't think I ever want to go back to that place. Would you like to play Gwent? Build your boats in Pinewood? Of course not. Wench dragged me some pints so I'd make her a cradle. Boat business not booming? Not well at all. Ain't no fish. Heard you're a good boat right. And an even better card player. Wanna play? Always ready for a round. Where'd you come from? Okay, looks like I've got a new card. Um, what do you do? Place on your opponent's battlefield and draw two cards from your deck. Okay. That's fine. I actually want a card like that, so let's dump something. Or, maybe I don't have to dump something. No, I don't. Yeah, I guess there's a minimum number of cards in your deck, but you can have as many as you want. Uh, but let's actually get rid of poor fucking infantry. Because it sucks. Yeah, so I've still got to have one more thing in there. Alright, put one back in. Okay. Let's go. Oh my god. I don't need this much, fro uh, this much fog. Uh, is it the same thing? Yep, draw two cards from your deck, put on your opponent's battlefield, yep, same thing. You lose short-term advantage, but you gain long-term advantage from the card draw. Uh, in that case, I guess I could just pass my turn, right? Or, actually, we can do the same. There. We're even. Oh god. Oh wait, that also goes on mine. What does that do? Uh, same thing, also still draw two cards from your deck. Hmm. It's weird that they do the same thing, but this one gives me a lot more damage. Seems like that makes it worse, right? Because you're giving that more damage to your opponent. I guess I might as well just pass my turn. Letho. No. Oh. I don't get how that works. You pass your turn and then you lose, but if you don't pass your turn, it seems like you have more time? I, I, don't, I don't quite get that mechanic. It seems like never pass your turn is a good, <laughs> good thing to do. That's a lot of ranged. Holy crap. Way stronger than anything else I have in ranged. 
Let's put one down, and then maybe one of these will be able to take down range damage. Oh. Wait, why did you do that? Swap a card on the battlefield to return it to your hand. Why would you do that? That's very strange. Guess I'll put some little dude up front. Don't need anything crazy, because they have no points on the board. Oh, you're putting it back in. Alright. So yeah, does, is one of these for ranged? That's close combat. That's siege. Uh, so I guess that's actually a no. We've got close combat and siege, but nothing for ranged. So, um, let's go for more melee damage. Oh my god, I, I cannot hope to win against their ranged. Holy shit. In fact, it might just be best to... Well, no, I can't pass my turn, because if I lose... I mean, if I lose this one, then I lose the whole game. Uh, hmm. I think I'm just kind of screwed here. No, no, don't do that. What about this? Impenetrable Fog card from your deck and play it instantly. Ah, okay. Excellent. Almost forgot about my special power. That is very, very useful. Wait, what is this? I guess I just drew because if I'm not quite sure what happened. I'm really bad at Gwent. I barely ever play it. Don't know what just happened, but I got a bunch of cards, so cool. And I'm still winning, so cool. Jesus, at this point, I think I should just pass. I've got, I've got 23 to their 8. There's like nothing they can put on the board. Alright, this one might be a little bit tough. My cards right now are not very powerful. I'm gonna have to use a lot of like weather cards, I think. <laughs> My siege is just pathetic. I guess we go with ranged? Hmm. Let's go with up close and personal. Hmm. Okay, I need to use weather now. Yeah, let's take down the siege. It's this one, right? Nope, wrong one. This one. Enjoy the rain. I don't know what they just did. I think they just used their hero power to do something. Don't know what. But I might as well just throw all my cards out there, because I need to win this round or it's over. So let's just throw everything out there. Thank you for the close combat infantry. Let's throw out some more ranged. I think I just win at this point. My s score is so much freaking higher. Oh! Holy shit! Never mind. I think I just lose the game. I don't have anything to play. What the fuck? I didn't know that could kill multiple cards. I thought it only took out one. Jesus. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything I can do.
Yeah, there's really nothing I can do. I guess Frost equalizes it a little bit, but they're still gonna win. Uh. <laughs> there's nothing I can do. This is hopeless. If I play this, it just makes it worse for me, because then their siege gets crazy big. Ah, <sighs> it's over. Ye lost, but you needn't get your breaches in a bunch. Round here they say... Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, come on. You again. Oh, why not? Always ready. Come on, rematch time. I really need more cards. Like, super, super bad. Need to redraw that. Much better. Oh, I've got two of these. Two of these. These have nice synergy against each other. Or, <laughs> synergy against each other. Synergy with each other. Hmm. Binding Frost is for close combat characters. I have plenty of close combat, so I don't want that. I think you want whatever weather card is probably covering up your weakest part of your your hand rather than the strongest, because then there's no need for it if you have a strong hand in that part of the that part of the board. All right, um, should I open up with something strong? Get these two guys doing close combat. Let's do it. Once you get them together, they will be amazing. I don't care about your damn ballista. Suck on this. 16 points. <laughs> I'm still winning. Wow, I have a lot of... I have a lot of ranged. Should I go for more ranged? Let's do it. And if I throw in this buff person, I think my ranged, or rather, not my ranged, my siege will be incredibly powerful. Let's do it. This is going to destroy them. Oh wait, I thought that buffed... Ah, oh, it doesn't buff all siege. Dang. What does this do? Choose one card from your discard pile and play it instantly. Oh. Oh, I don't have a discard pile, right? So I guess I... Well, I guess I shouldn't have played that. <laughs> Ranged it is. This game is getting crazy. Oh my god. I lose. I guess I'll keep dumping stuff in ranged and see what happens. But if they put another thing in ranged, I'm so guaranteed dead. Okay, they didn't. I stand a small chance, maybe. I'm not sure how long I can keep dumping cards in here before I just lose. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> this is all or nothing right here. Oh my god, we're just playing like literally all our cards. Alright, there's every single card on the first round. I think I win? Well, I've got to pass my turn. Or use my hero power. But I don't want to use it, right? No, that takes down... Uh, Fog takes down Siege, right? And I don't want to take down Siege because my Siege is more powerful than theirs. So, pass and hope. Please. Okay. But now what do I play? <laughs> I've got a single dude. How many cards do they have? They have two cards. 
Well, well, manly man, dude. Please be manlier than the other person. Ah, oh, they just drew a card. I'm screwed. I'm sp I'm screwed. They have three cards, I have zero. And now I have none. Hmm. <laughs> what? Fuck this, I'm never playing Gwent again. Lost, but you Shut up, I'm leaving. I don't know, do I want to keep playing Gwent? It kind of sucks when you don't have many cards. Like, I have such terrible synergy. I don't have enough cards to get anything going. Uh, maybe I should come back to Gwent later when I've got more cards. But then again, it seems like you kind of need to win Gwent to get cards. Like, I think cards are rewards for finishing this quest. Uh, I don't know. But the fact is, I don't want to play anymore. Well, you know what? I've finished pretty much all of the quests that are around my level. And I don't want to get too out-leveled from the main quest. Because before I was like level 10 and 11, and my main the main quest was like level 6. And that was a bit of an issue, so let's actually get back on the main quest. Let's do Pyres of Novigrad. Because that's a main quest, it's level 10, I'm level 12. Let's just do it. You know, I'm guessing that the game is designed in such a way that if you go with a main quest, it's probably going to take you to areas that are around the same level. Like the areas around Novigrad or around where I'm going to visit Triss are probably around level 10 too. So, yeah, I think I'll just go back on the main quest and then probably hit up question marks and any side quests that kind of spring forth from it. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm going to go visit Triss.